Brian Brammer from Gallatin, Missouri, attending the University of Missouri, majoring in Agricultural Education Masters. I grew up on a farm in Northwest Missouri in Gallatin, where I showed livestock from a young age, being involved in 4-H and FFA, so I showed everything from hogs, cattle to horses. Then I found myself at the University of Missouri. It was always where I wanted to go to school. I love Mizzou, have a great passion for the university, for our land grant, and I majored in science and agricultural journalism for my bachelor's, and now I'm pursuing a master's in agricultural education. And on the way to that degree, I had several international opportunities and that really opened my eyes, especially this summer in Africa, to the importance of international global education, especially relating to agriculture and how agriculture truly is uh, the one way people can succeed globally. So that what brought me to pursue a career in agriculture education. In the future, I want to be involved in agriculture organizations like the ones that sponsor my scholarship today and professional development opportunities. I feel like it's important to continually grow within agriculture. Your education doesn't stop after you obtain your degree. So that's important to me and to give back uh, to youth like we've seen today. So I'm so appreciative of this scholarship and that it will help alleviate some financial burden of my master's degree because I go to a great school, but great schools aren't cheap. I most look forward to seeing what agricultural policy initiatives either stay in place or change in the future. I had a summer internship in Washington, D.C. through AgriPulse where I got to interview individuals and learn firsthand about agricultural policy. I believe immigration, water rights, and land rights will be huge issues um, coming up. We also need innovators. We need students who are willing to major in the sciences field. We need women in STEM. We need advocates for agriculture um, from science, technology, to public policy. So I foresee that as the landscape, as the future of agriculture. I really see that we see that today in the scholarship recipients. They're majoring in everything from political science to plant sciences. So we have a wide array represented today.